Across October and November, 14 new battery energy storage systems were approved by ERCOT to begin commercial operations. These batteries are distributed across the state, with total capacity in the west and north load zone, shown here on the map in red and yellow respectively, growing by at least 450 megawatts. In total, capacity grew by just over one gigawatt of rated power, or 1.3 gigawatt hours of energy capacity in the past two months. This brings total installed capacity to around seven and a half gigawatts, or nearly 11 gigawatt hours through the end of November. Additionally, install capacity is increased by over 3.4 gigawatts, or around 85%, from around four gigawatts at the beginning of the year. The continued acceleration of the build-out has largely been made possible by the size of the average battery energy storage system continuing to increase. In this chart, we're again plotting total installed capacity, in this case by rated power, of batteries in ERCOT. Those batteries are represented by the bars on screen in various shades of purple. The bars are then grouped by the size of individual projects. For instance, projects that are 9.9 .9 megawatts or smaller are the lightest color at the bottom, while projects larger than 200 megawatts are darkest toward the top. As you can see, total installed capacity has continued to grow at an increasing rate, mostly as a result of an increased emphasis on larger projects. Six sites larger than 200 megawatts have become commercially operational. This has meant that the size of the average battery energy storage system in ERCOT has grown to nearly 50 megawatts, representing a 29% increase from the beginning of the year. To learn more about the current state of the battery build-out in ERCOT, head to the full article on the Moto Terminal now. Thanks for watching.